Okay, lesson, or rather, video 18, everybody. Yeah, video 18. And oh, and Marla would like to add something to my comments at the beginning of video 17, the last video. And that is when you're together with your English learner friends, don't be afraid of making mistakes. As Marla said, she and her friends in the past, as they were getting to be so advanced, they made all kinds of mistakes. Or just think of me, okay? If I were learning Portuguese, the native language for Marla and Mariana down in Brazil, <laughs> heck, I'd be making 10,000 mistakes a minute, okay? Don't be afraid of mistakes, okay? You can learn from your mistakes, all right? Well, let's set sail and come right down, and here we go. To be good gardeners, like George, Randy, and he, will need help from Teacher Don. Oh, yeah, gardening help from Teacher Don? Oh, come on. Well, George, oh, he says drop out the... Church, Randy, and, let's see, to be good gardeners like he, like he, haha, <laughs> right, like him, and therefore, yes, church, Randy, and him. There you go. To be good gardeners like church, Randy, and him will need help from Teacher Don. Yeah like him, okay, not like he. The skin doctor guaranteed that she would eliminate the abnormal growths on the skin forever. Oh, guaranteed? Uh, Mariana. Warranted, right, warranted, and warts, yeah, starts with W-A- are also just like warranted. Here you go. The skin doctor warranted that she could eliminate the warts forever. Ooh, skin doctor. <laughs> Julia, yes, she anticipates our English term for a skin doctor. Right, Julia? Dermatologist. Okay. The smell of sea animals drifted toward us. Oh, look at this. Boy, I don't know if you could call the walrus beautiful, okay? Well, I guess beauty is in the eyes of the beholder, okay? Yeah, sea animals, walruses, and wafted, right, Randy? There you go. The smell of walruses wafted toward us. Ooh, what are those? Who and Marla's got it. Tusks, yes, the tusks coming down from the mouth area of the walrus. There you go. Our biggest surprise were the millions of prairie dogs. Ooh, look at these cute prairie dogs here. Yeah, surprise were charge oh he gets it right away yeah surprise is singular so was right surprise was even though millions is plural okay yeah our biggest surprise was the millions of prairie dogs the moose would rather walk in shallow water in water than sway when walking through grass. Uh, get rid of the awkwardness by supplying the words, Miriam. Wade, yes, wade, and waddle. There you are. The moose would rather wade in water then waddle through grass. Oh, look at this handsome moose here on the right. Oh, there he is swimming on the left. 
Trump might go back and forth on temporarily dropping the requirement. Oh, Asa, he might go back and forth, yes, waffle and waving, yes, temporarily dropping, waving with that I before the V. Not, not spelled the way you would if you said waving my arm, okay? This waving. Pronounced the same way, though. Trump might waffle on waiving the requirement, the requirement. How can I prevent my child from wandering off at the state fair? Oh, yes. Look at that, everybody. Some people resort to um, yeah, having a leash for the child. It's so dangerous with the crowds at the state fair. Okay? Very upset. Oh, yes. Oh, this quick-hitting idiom. Yeah, this short one. Beside herself. Oh, she's just beside herself. She's so upset. Beside herself now. Giselle is especially anxious to receive a chocolate cake for returning to class this fall. Ooh, there's the anxious thing. Oh, when it's a happy thing, though, that you want. Yep, charge. Yep. Eager. Right, there you go. Giselle is especially eager to receive a chocolate cake for returning to class this fall. Eager. I opened my billfold and donated $20 for a type of dance with the bride. Okay. Oh, yeah. Well, will you give a little donation, you know, to have a dance with the bride so that the bride gets a little pile of cash, okay, to take on the honeymoon, okay? Oh, a billfold is wallet, right, Miriam, wallet, and then waltz. There you go. I opened my wallet and donated $20 for a waltz with the bride. A really nice tradition, I think. Marla got rather pale-skinned after swallowing a big glob of gum. Ooh, look at this picture. Boy, that girl does look wan. Right, Julia, wan, because she swallowed a wad of gum. Yeah. Marla got rather wan after swallowing a big wad of gum. Last week, I catched a big northern by the small island. Oh, ho, 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 ho. He's wincing. He's covering his ears. Yeah, catched? No, no. Yes, charge. Caught. Okay, you do the you do the threesome. Today I catch. Yesterday I caught. For weeks I have caught. Catch, caught, have caught. There you go. Here it is. Last week I caught a big northern by the small island. As a politician person that dreams of becoming something, Don has seen his enthusiasm decline. Oh, yeah. Now, back in high school, I thought I'd run for political office. I was a, Julia, a wannabe. Yes. Yeah, I saw my enthusiasm wane. There you go. As a politician wannabe, Don has seen his enthusiasm wane. Julia, here you are. 
Julia's wooden shoes will bend permanently if she sings in the rain. Oh, yeah, don't go singing in the rain, Julia, or your shoes could warp. Yes, your wooden shoes, they could warp if she warbles in the rain. Julia's wooden shoes will warp if she warbles in the rain. Can I burn leaves in my backyard? Well, if you do it carefully, yes, okay. Yeah, it is now permitted, yeah, to burn leaves in the backyard. The boss, oh, here we go again, the boss, all right, the head honcho, the top banana, ooh, the big cheese, okay, there it is, Marcelo, the big cheese. Oh, and for discussion, a close call. Ooh, when you and your friends uh, had uh, a very close encounter with a really bad accident. Ooh, yeah, where you just got by. Oh, something bad could have happened. Yeah, close call. Talk about that for English practice. There was a large red truck on an Iowa road that Michael pulled into town all by himself. Oh, there. <laughs> Marla, Marla gets right after it again. She says, oh, Michael pulled the truck into town? Oh, man. Uh, or, oh, wait a second. On an Iowa road that Michael pulled into town? No, I, I misspoke there. Marla, sorry. Yeah. Oh, all right, yes, out at the beginning. On an Iowa road, there was a large red truck that Michael pulled into town all by himself. Wow, Michael, wow. Elena, your husband is a muscle man. Yeah, ooh, look how truck is right in front of the word that. Oh, man, do I like that wording. Church admitted that the hearing qualities are terrible. Oh, the Church, yes, the acoustics. Acoustics, you acknowledged, yeah, up top there, acknowledged that the acoustics are terrible. Church acknowledged that the acoustics are terrible. Yeah, admitted. Yeah, and hearing qualities. Acoustics. Miriam has gotten many new ones previously met in Argentina. Oh, Miriam, when you go down to visit your grandson, okay, yeah, little one, yeah, you have acquired, yes, new acquaintances, right? Miriam has acquired many new acquaintances in Argentina. Yep. Marcelo is quite a bit stronger than anyone on his rugby team. Well, wait a minute. Marcelo is on the team. He can't be stronger than himself. Oh, yes, yes, Julia, right. That's where you put in the word else, anyone else. Marcelo is quite a bit stronger than anyone else on his rugby team. Joe was insistent the jury should not declare not guilty just because of the red hair. Ooh, look at this guy with the red hair. Yeah, and there's the jury. Oh, and Joe was adamant, yes, that, yes, Marla, acquit, declare not guilty. Joe was adamant the jury should not acquit 
just because of the red hair. Mariana is skillful at curing a harmful habit. Oh, Mariana, oh, you've helped some friends, okay? You are adept at curing an addiction, okay? Mariana is adept at curing an addiction, okay? Yeah, she lays down the law. She puts her foot down. Oh, Miriam, that idiom. Do you like the Como Conservatory as much as the zoo? Oh, they're both wonderful, everybody. Yeah, I suppose the zoo is more fascinating because of the moving animals, right? Okay. Do you like the Como Conservatory? as much as the zoo, the Como Zoo. Don't get mad, okay? Now don't, don't get angry here. Don't, uh, don't, here's one, fly off the handle. There's an extra idiom. Or how about this, Marcelo? Yes. Don't blow your top. Come on, control yourself. Don't get mad. Don't blow your top. When a golf tournament is on TV, Randy could care less about the new yellow roses. Oh, and Julia, you get this one immediately, every time. Yeah, couldn't care less. Yeah, could not care less. Cares not at all. So, could not care less couldn't care less. When a golf tournament is on TV, Randy couldn't care less about the new yellow roses. Let's stop a meeting to the right next door room for more space. Oh, a little awkward with the definitions, but hey, Asa, Adjourn, to adjourn a meeting, yes, or yes, adjacent is correct, yeah. Let's adjourn to the adjacent room for more space, okay? Adjourn, adjacent. Before you conduct the test, please properly change the lighting. Oh, well, this girl is testing away here, but, oh, administer, right, Marla, administer the test, okay, and adjust, okay, to adjust the lighting. Before you administer the test, please adjust the lighting. Administer, adjust. I felt kind of lucky when it drizzled on my new sod. Ooh, kind of, sort of, kind of, sort of, no, no, no. Yep, Marla, rather or somewhat. I felt rather lucky when it drizzled on my new sod. Not kind of lucky, rather lucky. Joan will have to change to be okay with something new to the severe pain in her right shoulder. Oh, a little awkward, but it won't be once Asa puts in the words. Yeah, we'll have to adapt, right? Have to adapt to the acute pain, right? Severe. Joan will have to adapt to the acute pain in her right shoulder. On a brick wall, this old tape won't stick enough. Oh, we know those, Miriam, don't we? Yeah, stick, yeah, adhere, and enough, adequately, 
Okay. On a brick wall, this old tape won't adhere adequately. Should I buy another pair of new shoes? I think you should. Yeah, I think you should, Mariana. Yeah, a pair of black high heels, and then, yes, these, uh, these, these purple tennis shoes, okay? Or, I don't know, informal shoes, those purple ones there. Yeah, should I buy another pair of new shoes? Yeah, go ahead. Should review material to be learned, okay, should master the new material. Oh, Marcelo, ha <laughs> you're right. Should brush up on it. I should brush up on it before the test. Brush up on it. Oh, in our last page of video 18. Every one of my teammates was really enjoying themselves last night. Who and Marla says, plural, plural, plural. All right, let's do it. Okay, we can go plural, plural, plural. All of my teammates were really enjoying themselves last night. Yeah, everyone as one word or everyone in two words everybody oh problem words okay yeah you can get away from them with with a plural that will let you say the same thing okay the strong light ray from the guiding light led us to the shore okay oh there it is oh that strong beam, okay, from the beacon, yes. The strong light beam from the beacon led us to the shore. I can't, I think that is a lighthouse, everybody. Yeah, and its beacon is sending out a beam of light. The smallest wood gnawing animal in a stream had the most energetic conduct. Ooh, we've had conduct. Or, let's see, I think we had this in the reverse. Yeah, we had the definition behavior, and then the word was conduct. Here, it's turned around. Okay, wood gnawing animal in a stream? Beaver, right. Ha <laughs> ha. Marcelo? The smallest beaver had the most energetic behavior. Yeah, Ooh, that smallest beaver huh, was a ball of fire. There's our idiom. Here you go. The smallest beaver had the most energetic behavior. I hurt my left bicep. Uh, uh, uh. That's right. That's right, Miriam. Yep, no such word as bicep. Always biceps. There you go. I hurt my left biceps lifting the last piglet out of the sty. Okay? Biceps. To look your best, you'd better call in a salon professional. Oh, ho, ho. Julia, yes, beautician. You, yeah, you got it right away. How about above that, though? Call in. No? Oh, now you've got it. Yeah, beckon. There you go, beckon. To look your best, you'd better beckon a beautician. A Black Friday sale can be an amount marker of Extreme disorder, oh, all the people piling into the store, yeah, to get the big buys, the great discounts. Ooh, yeah, ooh, yes, Marla, benchmark, an amount marker, a good indicator, yeah, benchmark, and then 
bedlam. Yes, extreme disorder. There was just bedlam at Target on Black Friday. A Black Friday sale can be a benchmark of bedlam. Are you going to a Memorial Day picnic? Oh, at the end of May, are you? Oh, let's hope for good weather by then. Are you, Randy? Are you going to a Memorial Day picnic? Determine the truth, okay? Yeah, find out what's real and what isn't, okay? Yeah, <laughs> Marcelo, right. Good idiom, Marcelo. Get to the bottom of things. Come on. We'll get to the bottom of things. We'll find out the truth. Oh, that was, that was the end of video 18. So thanks, helpers. We'll see you soon, everybody, for video 19. Till then, bye-bye.